Hey there, everyone out there, and welcome to another edition of Jeff Rambles, the series where I talk about whatever is off the top of my head on days where I should have a video ready for you people, but I do not. And today, the thing I'm going to be rambling about is exactly why I don't have a video ready for you today, even though I have many, many recordings all done and ready to go, but this is what you got. So let me, oh, ho, let me explain the myriad of issues that are going on, making me want to bash my head against a wall over and over again. So first off, uh, the the whole thing that I've I've been having some some issues here with is that for my face cam, I record off of you know, my iPhone, which I'm doing for you right now. Now. The, ba the big problem there is that I have, uh, I've, I've never been able to get my videos directly from the phone to my computer for the editing process. And there's two reasons for that. One is that oftentimes the video just won't even be there in uh, the file explorer when I hook it into my computer. So it's just like, uh, nope, nothing's here. Invisible. Doesn't exist. And the other main issue there, number two, is that when uh, it does actually see the video, and I am able to move it, because it's, uh, you know, Apple, and they make everything so that it only interacts with their own crap, uh, for some reason, I was not able to use whatever video format it was being done in my editing software. I use HitFilm Express. It's a free software that's actually pretty robust, but it would not recognize the videos that I could actually locate and move. So that's, you know, a, a whole big deal. So the workaround that I've been having to do is essentially I, I do my recordings and then I upload them privately to YouTube, which is a process that usually takes several hours because these videos come off of my phone anywhere from just under one gigabyte to like 15 gigabytes. I'm not sure why they end up being so ginormous, but I don't know, maybe it's the it's uh, 1080p at 60 frames per second that I record at. I don't know what the big deal is, but they, they come out, you know, huge, and therefore they take a very long time to do that upload. Um, and then, you know, when I, uh, I go in and I download them on my computer from YouTube down directly to, to you know, to my computer, which comes at, it, you know, that, that process is fast. That process is not really any problem, but, uh, it does come at a reduced quality from what I originally produced, which is very sad for me, but uh, that's just what I've been having to deal with. Uh, so yesterday I decided uh, I am done with this because it is such a freaking hassle, such a pain in the ass, and one of the worst parts of it is that any dip or waver in the, the connection, or at least that's what I think is causing this issue. It could be something else entirely. Uh, makes it start all the way over from 0% from the very beginning of the upload. So I just have it here, my phone on, uploading to, uh, you know, YouTube private, and it gets up to 60, 70, 80%, whatever, and then suddenly, bam, back to zero, starting from scratch after like two and a half hours of getting as far as it did. So, the fact that it was unreliable and had took so long, you know, yesterday I was like, screw it, I'm just done with this bull crap, I have to figure out a solution. So, you know, I, I uh, went into various Facebook groups, I posited my issue for a lot of people and got some suggestions, most of which were completely unusable because they all suggested I do stuff that I said was, uh, I already said was unfeasible for me. <laughs> so, you know, those are people who didn't read. And, uh, 
eventually I was able to uh, figure out, uh, well, not figure out because I still don't understand it, but I was able to solve the problem of why I couldn't just directly transfer from my phone to the computer because it could not see videos. Uh, I just downloaded iTunes and suddenly all the videos it couldn't see, now it can see them. <laughs> um, I don't know what that has to do with anything, but Apple, right? That's what they do. That's what they do. You can only do shit with their own shit. And I realized that I just did harder curses than I like to do on my channel, whatever. That's how frustrated I am. That's how upset I am at this whole thing. So finally, finally, I'm able to just put them directly from one to the other. Awesome. And I also downloaded a program called Handbrake for video conversion. It's uh, you know, a, a video converter that's for free, but also doesn't put a watermark on the videos, which is awesome because every other uh, conversion software I had found, uh, either I had to you know, pay for, which I can't do because I am, you know, flat broke. I don't have those that can uh, any kind of money to do that with or yeah, the free ones would always put a watermark, which is just unacceptable. I cannot have that. Ew, disgusting, gross. So I've, I got that, boom. Uh, now I'm having, uh, keep in mind that this is like at midnight, I'm finding this problem happening. I uh, I finally have my, my uh, face, cam, my face cam videos on the uh, on my my external drive that hooked up to my computer hooray go into my editing software import the the raw videos yay they fail part way through we're just i'm going through the i'm scrubbing through the footage okay okay it's all good it's all good Partway through on all of these, without fail, it cannot load. This is it can cannot load frame, and, and it's it's like halfway through all the way to the rest to the end. So this is after I was working on this for a little more than four hours. It's after midnight. I had to, you know, come to work today. That's where I am, as always, here in my car in the parking garage at work just before going in. Which means that uh, I had to, I had to stop at that point because I was like, okay, I'll just quickly edit these things, compile it, and then I can start the uploading process in the morning before I go to work and then finish all the detailing from my phone on my YouTube studio app, right? No, can't do that because now, even though the videos are in there, they're just not loading into the import for some reason. And I'm, I'm a broken man. <laughs> the, the file conversion takes some time to do, so I let one video convert overnight and I tried to put that one in this morning and I, I imported that this morning before I left for work and that did not have the, uh, the, the error. So I am hoping, hoping that, well, for one, uh, I've, I've changed one or two settings in how I record off my phone. Hopefully that'll, uh, fix that issue in some regard but also i hope that the file converger converger oh my god conversion tried to say converter and conversion at the same time <laughs> will uh, will also take care of that problem and uh, that's where i'm at right now and that's why you're getting this video instead of anything actually entertaining or important but that's what's on my mind today, so that's what you hear about. Sorry if it bored you to tears, uh, but if that's the case, we'll just sit through it and listen to the whole thing. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If this entertained you in any way, if my pain and suffering has caused you any kind of joy, 
hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and uh, leave a comment down below if you have any suggestions on what could be the problem that I might be able to finally, finally solve this whole conundrum with. Have a fantastic rest of your day. As always, just for sitting here, here, sitting here, sitting through this and having the patience of a saint, you guys deserve yourselves a great big hell yeah!